Welcome to BalsaCircle.com, your one-stop shop for all of your event decor. Today we're going to be showing you this beautiful flower garland backdrop curtain that's perfect for weddings, parties, events, and even trade show booths where you need that extra sparkle. So let's go ahead and get started. When you receive your backdrop curtain, go ahead and take it out of the packaging carefully because those foil flowers are delicate so you just want to be gentle with it. We want to separate all the strands of this backdrop curtain. That's just going to make it easier later on when we're actually putting it on a backdrop stand. So go ahead and spread it out on the table or gosh even the floor. Just be careful. The top of this garland has a ribbon that connects all the strands together and we're going to be using those loops at the top, those white loops, to actually put this backdrop curtain on a stand. Each of these foil flowers are about three to four inches across. The bottom is also going to have loops in case you need to secure it at the bottom or weigh it down. You know, maybe it's a windy area or a high traffic area and you need to weigh it down, you have that option. Now next, we wanna connect our beautiful backdrop curtain to the stand. We do have a video showing you how to set up a sample backdrop stand and we'll go ahead and link it in the description and in the cards. Go ahead and tie the edge of that ribbon to the top bar. It is going to slide if it's just there by itself, so that's why we're gonna connect all the little loops to the top bar as well. So now we're gonna show you how to connect those loops to the top of the backdrop stand. One of the methods we tried is zip ties. Now the only trick here is that if you are going to be using zip ties, make sure that you get the longer zip ties because it does have to go around that top bar. So depending on how thick that is, you just wanna make sure that you know, you're not scrambling and just go with the longer zip ties. And then just hide any excess or cut it off. So another way to connect this backdrop curtain to the stand is to use something we all have and that's ribbon. So if you don't have the zip ties and you're setting up for a wedding, you know, just grab a ribbon or any string that you might have. It doesn't have to be any special sort of ribbon. Here we just use a simple white satin ribbon. It just depends on what you have on hand. And our third method was to use craft wire. We always have a bit of craft wire on hand for DIY projects, so this was perfect. You just put it through the loop and then twist it around on top. And again, hide any excess material behind the top bar, or you can cut it off. So once you're done connecting all the loops to the top, go ahead and adjust it as needed. This backdrop curtain is six feet by six feet, so it's going to work with pretty much any stand that's out there. Most stands are about eight by 10 or 10 by 10, so it's just gonna be a little bit smaller than your stand, which is perfect. This backdrop curtain is gold, but we do have it in two other colors, in silver and white. So now you know how to set up this beautiful flower backdrop curtain and you're ready to celebrate. Grab your favorite photo booth props and your friends and just say cheese. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure that you give us a like if you did, share it with a friend and subscribe for all of your creative decor and event ideas. Until next time, stay creative.